Hello, welcome to this week's Innovation Zone Snapshot. The PACOB collates new packaging innovations every week for inclusion in our Innovation Zone packaging database. We've added more over the last week and the resource now has 4,114 initiatives from around the world. All the important packaging innovations in one place. My name is Paul Jenkins and I would like to run through four new initiatives for you again today. Don't forget to book on our next sustainable packaging webinar this Thursday the 6th of August. As well as reviewing 20 new sustainable packaging innovations, we have John Williams from Aquapack discussing their marine safe biodegradable film. Check out thepackup.com to book. Now for some new innovations. A new PET packaging initiative for aerosols has been introduced as an alternative to aluminium or tin plate cans and is suitable for a variety of applications. The new transparent plastic bottle from Austrian International Plastics manufacturer Alpla is extremely light and shock resistant and boasts functional benefits for consumers as well as some environmental advantages. The solution has an array of practical market uses for cosmetic products, deodorants, sunscreens and room fragrances. The lighter weight results in less material being used and lower consequent distribution costs that possibly reduces carbon footprint impact. The distinctive transparent appearance makes for a good point of difference on the retail shelf. The bottle consists completely of PET, making it recyclable. An internal coating used for aluminium and tin cans is not necessary. Various shapes, sizes and surfaces can be made. When it comes to present giving, it is perhaps a frequent frustration for parents whose children play with the box more than the toy. E-commerce giant Amazon hopes that it might help reinforce this behaviour as well as take a step in the right direction from an environmental perspective. The retailer is introducing boxes that can be recycled into a variety of post-use formats such as cat condos, forts, rockets, robot costumes and other creations. The boxes with built-in play factor have a call to action to recycle the boxes with a QR code. This directs consumers to a special landing page to make the cardboard concepts. Amazon has been making progress on reducing plastic waste as part of its Less Pla Packaging, More Smiles program. It is claimed that it has reduced the weight of its packaging by 33% and eliminated more than 880,000 tonnes of packaging material in recent years. New solvent ink technology is being introduced that makes colour changing inks more cost effective and easier to implement. The changes allow for a full series of hot, cool and sunlight activated pack surface options for food and beverage brands. The specialty inks popular for creating special effects on packaging for beer and carbonated soft drinks are now feasible for water and coffee cups. The development helps to speed up manufacturing operations. Previously, printers have used water-based inks that have a slower manufacturing process. The new range of colour changing technologies using solvent inks from Chromatic Technologies Inc. The range from the Colorado Springs based business includes temperature activated thermochromic, sunlight activated photochromic, glow in the dark and reveal technology inks where a message or communication is exposed once the product has been consumed. The new solvent specialty inks eliminate the operational hurdles of water based inks. CTI offers an in-house design service to help develop concepts that can be quickly tested with consumers. UK startup Polymateria is developing a new technology that would see plastic automatically biodegrade to leave no trace. Polymateria is working with Imperial College University in London and technology is called biotransformation. The process fully biodegrades common forms of plastic to leave behind no microplastics and therefore no lasting environmental impact. The development of some biodegradable solutions in the past has struggled due to the creation of microplastics. There can also be issues with biodegradable packaging's compatibility with recycling operations. The development of the Cycle Plus plastic sees a solution that will biodegrade after about three years. The plastic is still recyclable during its use usable lifetime. This opens up the exciting possibility of creating packaging that is both recyclable and biodegradable. Polymaterial's other development, Degrade, is a material designed for single-use plastics where recycling is unfortunately not an option due to littering. This material begins breaking down within six months. The solutions have good potential to scale up quickly with 
without significant costs. Polymateria has received additional funding to accelerate its development.